from what you can gather right now, what, what should Arkansas businesses expect in terms of what their responsibilities are going to be, what regulations they're going to have to follow. I think what business wants to know is what's the bottom line on health care coverage? Are we going to still we're going to be able to stick with our plan? The answer is yes. Uh, are we going to be able to have more options on plans? So for, will there be more competition in the market? I hope the answer to that is yes. That's where we come into these what they call state exchanges. And as you know and all your viewers know, there's been a huge problem not just in Arkansas but around the country with small businesses and individuals and families getting health care coverage unless you work for a big company or if you work for some government entity like a school district or the federal government or something you get good health care but for those other people those millions of people all around the country that own small businesses that or work for small businesses or small firms uh, it's been a real challenge. And one thing I like is in 2014 um, once the, all this phases in and all finally takes effect, uh, one thing I like is that a small business, you know, with, one, with just one employee or just five or ten employees, they should be able to get basically what we think of today as group coverage. And what that means is they should have the buying power of an employee of a Fortune 500 company or of, the, of even a federal employee because they should be able to get into one of these exchanges and have access not just to one company but have maybe a dozen or more private insurance companies to choose from.